Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, Librans. Uh, happy Valentine's. Um, please remember, if you want to see the extended of this reading, you gather, use the join button. The extendeds are really powerful in this month. Happy Valentine's Day, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go in your reader. Judgment call, ladies and gentlemen. Judgment call, judgment call on a Aries, Leo, Sagittarius person between the ages of 18 and 45. This could be also between the ages of 18 and 50. Judgment call is coming down on a person between the ages of 18 and 50. They're recognizing the lies and deceptiveness of this person. Whoever this person is, they are now recognized and have every information to recognize that this person is a very deceptive person. This person is a young Aries Leo or Sagittarius. This person is between the ages of uh, 18 and 50. So judgment comes down on this person, man or woman, whoever this person is. A huge judgment call came down on this person because they're recognizing the on the dishonesty of this person and people are seeing the truth of who this person is. So, all right. So what we have to do, what we have here is that uh, I see that some of you liberal women um, are dealing with a situation with a, um, you know, you liberal women are dealing with a situation with a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person. All right. It's not showing. Um, it is a situation where some of you are dealing with a Capricorn woman. Now, it can a Capricorn for some of you. Maybe it's your mom, maybe it's your sister, whoever this person is. Um, a Capricorn, some of you will be um, recognizing a situation um, with a Capricorn woman. It can, could come up as a mother or a sister or a grandmother. But um, whatever is transpiring, this woman turn her backs on you, um, Libran. This woman recognize and turn her back on you, Librans. Um, I don't see... Um, any new start with you and this woman, this lady have made her decision. She is focusing on her family and a new start with her family, um, in another place, in another country. This person is now focusing on her family. She recognized that you liberals, um, have not been very honest and she has turned her back in the past and now she's focusing on on her child, her husband, her um, her family that is in another country. And she recognized that you have not been very honest. And she's showing you liberals up. Wow. So whatever is transpiring, a lot of you are dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person. Whoever this person is, whether it's a family member, it's coming up as a family member or a friend. This person has ended any a connection with you and recognize that you have not been honest. You have been a very deceptive person. It could be a mother-in-law or that sort of a thing. This person has turned their backs on you and is moving forward. So in the foundation of this month, what we see is that um, a lot of you are going to be receiving some sort of a um, good news um, when it comes up uh, to your financial stability or good news from your Mother could be coming in for some of you. Good news that you overcome some sort of a situation with an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius. Maybe it's a sister, a friend, or a family member. They are recognizing that this Leo person have created a criminal offense and a uh, uh, um, and a Aries man have helped this Libran person to create this criminal offense. So they are now recognizing. So a lot of you Libras, they are now recognizing that whoever this Leo person is, man or woman, a judgment call is coming down on them because they recognize that they are the one that created some sort of a deceptive play, the Seven of Swords, and they had done it with an Aries man, an Aries businessman, and they're recognizing this. So a lot of truth is coming out, Libras, and um, beware and aware of what is transpiring because 
Um, you Librans could be caught up in a situation that you should not be in the first place involved because they use you Libran and you got to recognize that people had used you Librans in the past and give a, a, a Aries person, a Aries person have used some of you Libran. The judgment call is coming down on this Aries person. So be aware because people have now recognized what this um, Leo person I've done, and this Leo person has created some sort of a deceptive uh, nest with an Aries man, an Aries businessman, or an Aries man. Maybe it's there, um, this Aries man is having some sort of a um, relationship with this person, whatever is happening. It could have been their lover, or it could have been a side piece chick, but this Aries businessman, they recognize the lies and deceptiveness of an a uh, young Aries between the ages of uh, 18 and 50 and a 50 year and older Aries businessman and the lies and deceptiveness. Ooh. So, liberates. All right, so um, let's look at the week. So we see light has been shed on the situation and the end is here for a um, Leo. Um, debt comes up end for an Aquarian person who have created some sort of a problem or an end for a Libran person that has created some sort of a deceptiveness in the second week. The third week, I see a lot of you are dealing with your mother, um, or with a Capricorn person and a Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius man. They're recognizing the horrible play that these people had made. The last week, the energy of the lovers, some of you could be dealing with the Cancers and the Geminis or with your husband. And some of you are thinking of uh, um, moving uh, to another place, another city and rebuild your life because you recognize how people have gotten you in some sort of a situation. And you're recognizing, I am leaving um, this situation behind. So let's go into freedom. So what we recognize is that the light has been shed. A scorpion has shed the light on a Leo, Aries Leo or Sagittarius person and is bringing um, some sort of an ending to some sort of a false play that a Leo person had created. People are now recognizing who this Leo person is and what this Leo person have done. And I see a lot of you liberals are going to be getting out of a situation because people now recognize light has been shed and people are now recognizing that a Leo person has not been honest. So light has been shed on you ladies, 50 years and older or ladies between the ages, um, uh, ladies on a whole. Um, if you are someone who was married, to an Aries Leo or Sagittarius person, you're realizing that this man has been lying all the time. Nothing that came out of this man's mouth was honest. So, um, so a lot of you ladies are now turning on this man, um, whether it's your husband, whether it's a, um, a business partner, whether whoever this man is. So a lot of you ladies are using the sword and it's turning on this man because now you ladies are recognizing that nothing that came out of this man's mouth was from honesty and truth. And you ladies are using the sword of truth and is taking down this man. You're recognizing that this man has been lying to you from the beginning until the end. This man is someone in another country or another state. And you're now recognizing how dishonest this man has been and have not told you the truth and has gotten used in some sort of a serious problem. So you ladies are going to be standing your ground and using the sword of truth and recognizing, hey, this man has been lying to me. This man has brought me in so much horrible situation that I need not be to he be in. And this man has created a whole lot of um, deceptiveness and didn't speak the truth. And, and this man is no businessman. They're recognizing that this man has a false... Um, principle of saying that he was a businessman when they recognized that this man was not a businessman. This man is on pension and have no money to survive and created some sort of a problem. So, oh my God, you, you, you guys are not recognizing this man. This man is coming up as an Aries man for a lot of you that you're recognizing that this Aries man has been lying all the time. And I see you liberals are going to be coming out of the situation because they recognize that this Aries man has led you down the rabbit hole. 
and it's very dark in there and you're turning on this man and speaking up against this man then we look at the second week at end go back and look at the general energy um this um general energy the end is here a lot of you are feeling the energy of this month um this energy was in the third week this energy was in the fourth week this energy stand in the place of the general energy so a lot of you are going to be affecting the feeling the month of uh, uh february because it's showing up here now what we're seeing is a uh, debt a transition an end uh, is going to be coming in and this end is a uh, um, end in a situation that you have been going through, Libran, but an end is definitely coming up for a um, Aries Leo or Sagittarian person because they recognize uh, some sort of unexpected, uh, on this honest situation that this person have done against a woman, a, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn woman, 50 years and older, and her family. And they're now recognizing um, that it is. Uh, um the situation that was created is that um is dishonesty dishonesty and uh, um not only dishonesty so it could be a family member a niece or a nephew or a sister that has used a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn information in order to accumulate uh, um and and business information in order to accumulate wealth and they're recognizing this and they're taking it down and i see that they're going to be ending it now what we see is changes is coming up for a aquarian woman now this aquarian woman could be a lawyer for some of you but some of you this aquarian woman could be your mom um for some of you this aquarian woman could be a boss so you have to recognize because these are personal readings so if you want to know if it's your work go to the work channel but you need to recognize some sort of undesirable play that had had created and that was that was created against all of you and you're now recognizing the pieces of the puzzle the people the situation because light is now shedding on a situation and they're now recognizing what was happening what was transpiring and you ladies how you ladies got caught up in some sort of a situation so they're going to be coming down a lawyer they're going to be coming down on someone um in a, a civil service um they're going to be recognizing that some sort of undesirable play was created by people in civil service in order to give a leo some sort of a stay um, or some sort of a new start and they're going to be recognizing that dishonest play was transpiring and they're ending it they're ending it they're ending it all right so let's look at the third week third week is going to be having some sort of a situation that is coming up with a lot of you um uh um liberals and your mother um some sort of a, a situation where if you liberals mother live overseas I see some sort of a good news is going to be coming in from your mother. So this is wonderful. So you liberals that uh, have mothers or children overseas, some sort of a positive news is going to be coming in and this is going to be good. Some of you, you could be going to visit your mother or your mother could be coming to visit you or your kids could be coming in to visit you. So this is going to be wonderful, wonderful alignment of energy. So this is really, really positive, especially for you women 50 years and older, some sort of a good news um could be coming in um from your kids that they're coming in to see you for um the valentine so that is good all right if your mother is a capricorn or a taurus virgo or capricorn and your and your father is an aries leo or sagittarius i see this lady is deciding to end her marriage with this man this lady i've recognized that this man is undesirable this man, um, this lady is also recognizing that whoever this uh, Aries man is, it is time to leave this person behind. This lady has showed up who this person is. So it could be your father, your stepfather, or it could be a family member, this lady brother or a family member. But your mom, if your mom is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person, this lady is going to be recognizing, hey, I got to end this connection and the situation and this work association with this person. This person is really deceptive and dishonest. And I need no longer to have myself connected to this person. And you are going to be recognizing this and making a whole lot of changes for yourself and recognizing what has been transpiring. So really, really wonderful, really positive, positive alignment of energy. People are going to be recognizing and it's going to be 
um, you know, seeing the truth of what has been transpiring and recognizing what was happening and how this Aries Leo or Sagittarius man has created a whole lot of false height and deceptiveness um, within your world. As we look at the last week, a lot of you are dealing with uh, kids, a lot of you are dealing with your husband, a lot of you are dealing with your partner's relationship. It is the month of February. And what is here and is transpiring, a lot of you, um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn person who was a friend or a husband or a wife, um, a same-sex relationship could be, or a sister, um, is going to be turning their backs on you, Libran, because they recognize that you, Libran, was not being very honest. And they're going to be turning their backs on you because they recognize that you, Libran, have not been really honest about some sort of a place, some sort of a situation. Um, you know, Lib you, Librans, were not speaking the truth to these people. And these people are going to be recognizing and saying, hey, um, you know, I make my decision. I'm looking forward. I'm, you know, um, I'm here for my family and my kids, and that is what I'm going to be focusing on. Um, you know, the focus is, uh, um, there, you know, this could be a modern law. You could have been and have created some sort of an issue for this lady child, and this lady is going to be turning their, her back on you, uh, guys, because they recognize the problems that you have created for their child and they are ending this. They're ending this. They're, they're really ending this and letting some of you know, Hey, I do not want to associate myself anymore. Do not come after my child and it's going to be protecting their children, um, from you, Liberans. So, um, you know, Liberans, um, um, a, a, a Taurus Virgo or Capricorn person is going to definitely, um, turn their backs on you in the month of February because they recognize, so, that, uh, you know, you are, you're not speaking the truth. They recognize that you have a whole lot that you're not saying. You keep the lid on something and a whole lot. And you're, rec this lady is like, bye, I don't, I don't really want to deal with you anymore. Um, it is an old lady and this lady is going to be not saying anything to you is just that you recognize the communication is not there anymore and you're going to be recognizing what is happening and transpiring okay uh i see this lady as someone is, is a person of peace they just want their peace they recognize that you had created some sort of a false play you did not speak and really um you know be honest about situation and they're going to be she's going to be just turning her back and looking forward then we recognize uh, that this lady is looking um, away from a lot of you and is thinking about creating uh, some sort of a balance for her family. She is now focusing on her family. She is now focusing on bringing her family back together and healing whatever situation that was transpired with her family. She is more focused on her family at the moment and building some sort of a stability for her family so that she knows that when she has moved on, um, she is recognizing that she left a legacy for her family. So I see this lady is only focusing on her family and the people that is close to her heart. And she is letting go of you liberals, however it may be. Is it a family member? It can be a family member that has recognized that, um, you know, you have not been, uh, fr the frequency that you're carrying is not matching their frequency and their lady they're, they, they're just separating themselves. They're not even telling you. They're just separating themselves and is uh, um, focusing on their family and building their stability back. Wow. So let's go and see. So what we're seeing here is that um, some sort of an ending is coming in for a Leo person in your life, Libran. Changes are um, definitely coming up for a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Um, this lady recognized that there was some um, situation where people were, were not speaking the truth and tried to get away with something. A lot of you are going to be successfully recognizing who a Leo is and what a Leo have done. I see a lot of you are going to be um, more connecting with your family, your mother, 
and recognizing that your mother had seen the light to a situation. And I see you, especially ladies, you're going to be more connecting with your mother or with an older figure um, person. Some of you ladies are going to be regretting that you had not been honest to a Taurus River or Capricorn person because this person recognized that you were not honest. And I see that some of you ladies are going to be turning on a Aries Leo, Aries Leo Sagittarian man because you ladies recognize that an Aries man had lied to you and did not speak the truth. You can see this. This man did not speak the truth. And a lot of you are Aries. The light is now going to be shedding and you're going to be recognizing. And I see you're going hardcore on this man because you recognize that this man did not speak the truth. Was it your husband? Was it a family member? Who is this man? You recognize that an Aries man had lied to you, Leo, Librans. Then we're moving forward and we're looking. You ladies are going to be, um, you know, focusing on your family overseas or your mother uh, overseas. Whatever is transpiring, um, I see you ladies focusing on this person overseas, whoever this person is, is like a mother figure or um, someone who you truly love and care and adore. And this person is overseas and you're focusing on this person, maybe overseas or in another country, in another state. And you're focusing on this person because it's as if you miss this person, you want to talk to this person. But because of uh, some deceptive play of an Aries man or an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian man has changed um the relationship between you and this person and I